Hey, welcome back to Job with Jeff. I've got my Bible and my beverage, and it's been a few weeks since I've been, been with you because I've been out of the country. I've been in Bangladesh. Bangladesh is that part of the world that's next to Pakistan. Once upon a time in 1971, Bangladesh broke away from Pakistan to become its own country, which is a really fascinating story all by itself. But Bangladesh today is 90% Muslim and only 3% Christian. And I was in Bangladesh training some Christian leaders on a master's level strategic leadership course. And uh, I got to tell you, it was eye-opening, it was exciting, it was humbling to be with a few of the Christian leaders who are making a big difference in that country. And again, only 3% of their population are Christians, and I'm looking at 24 of them in the room. It was, a more, it was amazing, it was extraordinary. It just reminded me that the gospel is simple. The, the same message that they're, they're trying to share around the world in Bangladesh is the same message that we're sharing here in the United States of America because the gospel message of Jesus is simple. It's the good news. And Paul summarized it really well in Romans chapter 5, verse 8. And here's what he said, But God demonstrates his own love for us in this, while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Simple, simple gospel message is that Jesus died for those of us who have made mistakes against God, which is everyone. And this message of forgiveness is for everyone around the world, whether in Bangladesh or here in the United States or anywhere. It's the same message, it's the same Jesus. And it's a simple message of of good news that Jesus came to earth and died on a cross for the forgiveness of sins and he rose on the third day just as he said he would do, conquering death itself and sin and the devil. And that same message is what these Christian leaders in another country around the world are telling everyone just like we should be doing here. So be encouraged. Be encouraged as a follower of Jesus that you've received this gospel message and be encouraged that you need to go share it with the people around you. I hope this is encouraging to you and I look forward to getting back together with you next week.